financial literacy is not something that we all um, can learn in a day or even sometimes in a lifetime. It's like life. Once you think you got a beat on life, things change, environments change, and you have to adapt. And that's what financial literacy is. And at the end of the day, when you're talking about your own financial uh, well-being, it's competitive. You have to understand what you're getting yourself into. And it's, it's kind of like a game. Every season, every quarter is different. You know, uh, and it, that's what made it so real and so fun for me. And I, I'm assuming it was as fun for everyone involved today. It's a powerful tool and I think it's a powerful platform that they have and they're doing great. I thought today's financial football event was incredibly energizing and fun and educational. I think it is incredibly important for Visa to continue uh, running programs like this for students across the country because it provides students with a fun, engaging way to learn more about financial empowerment and financial literacy. The energy in the room was incredibly high. I asked a lot of the kids after the game, did you learn something, one thing? And they said, I learned so much. Today was fantastic. I mean, Visa puts on this incredible program, financial football, and it's just a real fun and engaging way to bring students together to teach them about financial literacy, but do it in a fun way where there's high energy and there's enthusiasm, and it's a great way to incorporate play with learning, and uh, we just hit a home run today. Kids learn differently, and I think having different ways of teaching methods is really valuable, and financial football has just been a great tool. I think personally the most important lesson for students is that they are responsible for building their own future and part of that responsibility is knowing how to manage your finances.